Lately, I've been hearing a lot about this mod pack called Figure Nightfall, and that is why today I'm going to teach you how to download and install this Minecraft mod pack in a super, super simple way. Let's go ahead and get started with this tutorial. Now, the first step for downloading and installing Figure Nightfall is to actually install CurseForge. CurseForge is a mod pack loader, which is going to allow us to install a bunch of mod packs like Fear Nightfall and many, many other mod packs with just a click of a button. So that's why we're going to install Fear Nightfall through CurseForge because otherwise, if we were to do it manually, it will take us a very, very long time to download all the files, to so download every single mod, set up Forge, set up Fabric or whatever mod loader we want to use. So we're going to install CurseForge. And once we have CurseForge, we're going to install Fear Nightfall. All you have to do to install CurseForge is click on the second link in the description. This is our written guide. Feel free to read through it. But if you don't want to read through the guide and look at the screenshots, you can just click where it says download CurseForge here. That is going to redirect you to this page where you could scroll down and set this up for Mac or Linux. But for this case, we're just going to click where it says download a standalone because we're installing CurseForge for Windows. That is going to start the download automatically. In my case, it's asking me where to save it or it asks me where to save it. But for you guys, it's going to download right away. And once you have the CurseForge installer, all you have to do is launch it. Now, in my case, I already have CurseForge, so I'm going to go ahead and delete it. As you can see, guys, I'm uninstalling CurseForge. There we go. It's gone. I deleted CurseForge. All you have to do now is launch the CurseForge installer once you are ready, once you download the file. And that is going to open this menu here that is loading up, as you can see right here. You could change the language. We're going to leave it in English. You click next. Click that you accept the terms. Click next again. By the way, if you want to change the default installation of CurseForge, you just have to launch this file as, as an administrator. But um, I didn't because I don't care if it installs in my C drive. It does, it's not really a heavy software. It's not going to slow down my computer or anything. And then once CurseForge has finished installing, it's just going to open up. Now, when it opens up for you guys, it's not going to be the way it's going to be for me right now. As you can see, when it opens up for me, it's already here where it says my mod packs. For you guys, it's going to look something more like this. And then a little pop up will appear saying, do you want to run a little intro? You could just skip that. And then once you're here in this menu, in this screen, just select Minecraft, Minecraft. I can't even speak right now. And then once you're here in Minecraft, you're going to be in the my mod pack section. But this is probably going to be completely empty unless you have installed mod packs in the past. And to install Fear Nightfall, all you have to do is click on Browse. And then you could scroll down and try to find it in here. And Fear Nightfall actually does come up eventually. But if you can find it, all you have to do is type Fear Nightfall in here, just like so. And then it will come up and you'll be the first one. It's this one by this guy in here, Charky, I guess. I can't even pronounce his name. And then to install it, all we have to do is obviously click Install on the right side and just wait for Fear Nightfall to install. Once it finishes installing, it's going to show here in my mod packs. As you can see right now, it's still installing. Obviously, it's a lot of mods, so we got to give it some time. And of course, we can keep going without mentioning today's sponsor, Apex Hosting. If you want to create a server, even for a mod pack like Fear Nightfall or Our Craft, Better Minecraft, whatever mod pack you want, Apex Hosting got you covered. They'll make the server for you, actually, with just a couple clicks. And they'll give you 25% off if you use the first link in the description. Something that I personally love about Apex Hosting, besides all the advantages they provide you with, is that you could access the server console through your phone, so you don't even have to be at home to be able to change the settings, kick people out, change the weather, or whatever you want to do. It's your server, okay? I'm going to leave that first link in the description, and now let's keep going with the tutorial. Anyways, guys, after a while, Fear Nightfall will be installed. You see here it will stop loading and downloading stuff give it a little bit because it has more than 200 mods so you have to be patient for this mod to install and then once we have it all we have to do is click on play and here it's where a lot of people get confused and where i see a lot of comments of people being confused and stuff it will launch minecraft launcher however this is not your regular minecraft launcher this is a different minecraft launcher and chances are when it opens up it's going to have you log in again because even though this is like the official Minecraft launcher, it's being launched through CurseForge. So it's a different instance. That's it. All you have to do is log in with your Java account and you will see Fear Nightfall in here. It's not really that confusing. I know some people are a little bit confused, a little bit skeptical. All you have to do is log in. This is the regular Minecraft launcher. I log in here with my own account and then you will see Fear Nightfall in here. And in order to play it, all you have to do now is click on play. Click that you understand the risk. And by the way, anytime you're going to play Fear Nightfall, you have to launch it through CurseForge because if you open your actual regular Minecraft launcher, you won't see Fear Nightfall in here. You will have to open CurseForge, click on Fear Nightfall, and then you will see here selected automatically. And after a while, we will have Fear Nightfall already loaded. And this, I've heard a lot of things about this mod pack. Like I said in the intro, 
In order to play, all you have to do is click on single player and then you're ready to adventure into this uh, mod pack. Let's go ahead and actually launch a world. We're going to name it 2024. Why not? I'm going to change it to creative just so I can do the little outro and I could also record the intro because if you guys didn't know, I record my intros after I do my whole video just to make sure that the video works. Then I do the intro. By the way, remember first link in the description, you could create a server even for Fear Nightfall using Apex Hosting, okay? And after a little bit, as you can see, we are inside Fear and Nightfall and this game, it's a scary, I'm not gonna lie. This game just submerges you into a different world, a different Minecraft that we're not used to seeing. But yeah, that is pretty much how to download and install Fear and Nightfall. I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and a comment. And as always, bye-bye.